This is humiliating. Oh, would you relax? There's nothing weird about it. Nothing weird about it? You have me on a leash, Todd. It's not a leash. It's a lead. Don't play semantics. I'm not, Woody, because I don't even know what that means. Why don't you just hop up on my back, huh? I told you, I have a nasty saddle rash on my butt. Thanks for making me say it out loud again. Okay, well, why can't we just walk next to each other? Because, Woodrow, donkeys and humans don't do that. You're the only talking donkey in the world. What would people think if they found out? You'd be taken by the government and probed and used for who knows what kind of nefarious purposes. Oh, wow. Look who suddenly knows big words. You know I'm right. Ugh, fine. Shh! We're coming up on a village. <coughs> Let me do the talking. Greetings, villagers! I am Todd. This is my pet donkey, Woodrow. He doesn't speak, so don't try and ask him any questions. We are travelers from another dimension. Oh, gosh. Quiet. We mean you no harm. We seek food and shelter for the eve, and we'll continue our voyage in the morn. Why are you talking like that? It's how adventurers talk. Please take us to your leader. Why aren't they responding? Maybe they don't speak English. Hello. Hi. How's it going? I like your shoes. I'm gonna try Spanish. Hola! Great job. Huh. I thought that meant hello. I think we should go through. And I strongly disagree. Come on, Woody, haven't you ever wanted to go on an adventure? Todd, every day with you is an adventure. You're being sarcastic again. Todd, we have no idea what's on the other side. You want to leave our home and everything we've ever known? There's nothing here for us, Woody. Look, you're the only family I've got. And I'm the only family you've got. Except for your cousin Wilbur, but he's super weird. We don't even know what it does. What if we're incinerated? Then we'll be incinerated together. Well, okay. But if we're gonna do this, we do it- ME FIRST! Thank you.